Hey guys, I just wanted to make a short video, just me sitting in front of the camera, uh, pretty much talking about the future of the interwebs and video platforms. Um, hang on, my freaking, my dogs are being annoying. Back, trying to do a video, guys. Vidme, um, and why I'm super interested in this, it's just like, almost like perfect timing, and I just feel like YouTube in itself is just simply becoming super oversaturated. Vidme is a fresh start, um, but it's going to be super temporary, people are going to have to jump on vid.me. I think it has a lot of potential to contend with uh, YouTube because it's, it's very different. It's not a copycat website. Um, it's, it's a crossbreed between Reddit and YouTube pretty much. And the ranking system seems to be, you know, a lot different. But this just raises one question since YouTube is having a lot of problems. And that is pretty much if uh, big content creators are going to be making a move towards vid.me. Vid.me seem seemingly is growing super rapidly and it's just now kind of came out. I've only heard about this vid.me like four days ago and I started uploading my my YouTube videos to vid.me along with uploading to YouTube um, in hopes of having a jump start on this platform because um, I feel as though there is some potential to this platform. I'm still kind of learning about the platform, about the subscriptions and the following, uh, what, what distinguish between those two. Um, I know that when you follow somebody, it's just like if you subscribe to somebody on YouTube. When you subscribe to somebody, you have to pay an amount of money that the content creator sets. Uh, so say I can set it to $1, then people can subscribe for $1 and they get like exclusive content. They can get exclusive content from the content creator. Um, and they get like a little badge next to the name when they comment it. Um, and it just supports the content creator itself. Another difference for the vid.me that's super important is the transparency they're trying to have from the people that made vid.me and the content creators. They're trying to ha have it seemingly to where like they're going to be super transparent with the content creators because as you know on YouTube, it's a big problem with the people on YouTube just don't communicate very well with the big content creators. I've been on YouTube for a long time. I've made a lot of videos for YouTube. Um, I've been watching YouTube like it's my TV for the past like five years. Um, and it's just not the same. It's just turning... There's just a lot of controversy on it. So this is an open subject. Uh, whatever you guys think, comment below. Um, that's exactly what you think vid.me is going to be. Is it going to contend with YouTube? Is it going to overtake YouTube? Um, is the content creator going to move to vid.me? Um, what is the future of video platforms for the internet? So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I make vlogs. Check out my content. Go to my channel. Support. Follow me. Um, I will be active on the vid.me interwebs. And if you enjoyed this, if you enjoyed this video, and you have uh, any comments, questions, concerns, you know, comment them below. And uh, yeah, thank you, thank you for watching. And vid.me, it's a new era. I think YouTube does need some competition to change for the better. So I think vid.me does have some potential for that.